100% tarpon. Right here, middle of the night. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Hit him? Hit him, hit him, hit him. Gulf Coast Nation is sponsored by Sandbar Tackle, keeping you hooked. Steadfast Rods, the name says it all. Andy Andrews, New York Times best-selling author. Terra Firma Tackle, Austin Legacy Knives, every knife has a story, tell yours. Blink Slate Customs, Fish Gum, Excite the Strike, Pontchartrain Jigs. All right, guys, day number one right here, expedition number one, and a big one at that. We are on a bridge, obviously, at night right here. Blaine and I just got our rods out. Um, Spencer from Terra Firma Tackle and Cody from Sandbar Tackle is about to get their rods out. They're, uh, they're walking up and down this bridge right here, looking for cow nose rays, getting fresh bait. We, I'm gonna let these cars pass. One more. Set bait rigs. They're actually pulley rigs from Terraforma Tackle with sandbar tackle circle hooks. I believe it's an eight out in front and a five out in the back. Basically, our goal right here is actually really, really cool. There are some small bull sharks and black tips that run through here. We do appreciate those fish. We will have a blast with those fish. But there are cobia that run through this area. There are tarpon that run through this area, and um, we're just we're just really here to get on a land-based cobia. That's our main goal right now. Um, there's been some caught by some good buddy of ours and a good buddy of Spencer's in the past few days. So uh, if we can get on one, we will. Our baits are set right now. So just like normal, it's a waiting game. We're gonna kick back, relax. Blaine, you got anything for us? Hopeful? What are you, what are you wanting? I don't know, hoping, hoping to put a big legal cobia from land right, would, up, right up here on the bridge. Right from the bridge, that would be awesome. So after about 10, 10 and a half hours on the road, we're gonna see if our time invested in the truck is going to be translated to time invested on the pier on this bridge here but uh for now it's just a waiting game it's up to the fish let's do it is he pulling no i think he spit it dude they're hard to hook oh my gosh i mean you never really got hooked yeah there he is there he is all right blaine is getting eaten right now by what is almost 100 percent of tarpon he like ate it screamed with it and then skied out right here you still feel them on there a little bit no no you don't feel nothing. Uh, he just jumped the tarpon tarpon on tarpon on tarpon on tarpon on go on blink let's go no, I think I can just hand it. There he is. Don't punch. Don't punch. Slow lips. All right. Don't let. Don't do extra head shakes, bro. <laughs> do not give him an advantage. Generally, you can find him from the top of the bridge, right? Here. Oh, here. Oh, that's it, Blaine. I need my, fight, I need, fight, I need my hoodie off. You're good, you're good. Two seconds. Two seconds. Two. You can go up. Okay. Bottom from up. 
Pretty good. That's a big one. That's a real big one. Then to get him to swing. Give him all you got. Give him all you got. Give him all you got. He'll swing out, I think, if you get him over there. It's Chris. too late, he's well under. Switch out quick though, get your rod back in. Yeah. They yeah, probably pinned his face up against the tire that happens, dude. Like, to be honest, you're lucky you had him pinned on. <laughs> Darwin vision. Hit him? Hit him, hit him, hit him. Oh, yeah. Pop. Oh, How is that possible? He's on the counter. Three o'clock in the morning, another hour passed, and Matt has found himself. Countos, countos. Hey, Blaine. He's a okay. He's a big one. Middle of the night, waiting for that Kobe or next tarpon bite. That's 80 pound break. We uh, we uh, got a little something on the on the snagging right here. Get on him, Matt. Boat up, baby. Let's go. I don't know if you guys can see him, but he's right down here. Oh, oh, okay. Fine. Boom. Blaine. Get him off, get him off, hurry! Blaine, 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 get him off! Is that your first count on those? Yeah. Matt, There's congratulations. There's a whole school over there. Whole guy. school, whole That's school well. count those. That's fresh bait. So that is actually really good yeah. for tonight because we are not, we're not going to use that for bait this evening for what we're going after. But like I said, this is day one of the expedition and we have a couple more stops to make and that cow nose is going to come very much in handy for the next surprise we have coming for you guys. Okay, continuing on our late night action while we're waiting for these cobia. Matt, yet again. True, master. true hero. Oh yeah, baby. Oh yeah. Clay, what do you think about some fresh bait? I think it sounds great. All right, I'm going to go down here and grab this cow nose from Matt. Do I just wrap up again and lift him? No, 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 this is a tiny hook, you gotta grab him. Matt's on right now, on another cow nose, just snagged him. Stud. Nice cow nose. Dylan's also Stud on right down here. Woo! Doubled up on cow nose, baby, doubled up on cow nose. Like I was talking about earlier, not our target, but man, are these fish fun to fight, and they're gonna be fantastic bait for tomorrow's trip. So while we're sitting here waiting for our Kobe or tarpon to come by, this definitely passes the time and also checks another thing off the list. We need a bait, we got it. Yeah, you got the smaller hook. Yes. Stop. Watch out, watch out, watch out, watch out, drop the hook. Drop in front of him. Just get some light. 
Oh, I literally, I was taking it out of the water. Oh, yep, 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 yep. Is it blind? Oh. That's a nice one. Oh my gosh. It's like dragon. This is a fish I've been wanting to chase since I was a uh, I was a little kid. I used to watch shows on TV.